Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Your buddy John Megacycle here. Another episode of Cuba Factor. Whoa. Hello? <laughs> Mouse, you. We're good? Okay. Cuba Factorium coming out. Coming at you. That was weird. Um, let's see. Realistically, where I'm at with this game is a bit more cleanup, a bit more automation, and I'm going to be pretty satisfied with our rail base. Uh, maybe a quick a quick guided tour. Let's start with the newest stuff first. This is our really simple charcoal builder upper. I wanted there to be charcoal everywhere on the island, and this is all automated. The only thing that costs this costs is power, electricity, and that's that's really it. Um, this goes off to some various mining operations. Looks like we're catching up pretty well on that. And some storage, and some other locations where I've had some assembly, or yeah, this was the old hello, game save. Okay, this was the old charcoal generator. Um, the frost area is actually the best place to get uh, logs. It's 300 seconds for three wooden logs. It's actually the best ratio. Um, animals just stashing them up, so I have them. This is our smeltery. Works out pretty well. This keeps up very, very strongly with demand. Um, realistically, I've got to get some automation to turn this stuff into coils and plates and blanks and all kinds of crap. So that's fairly straightforward. This is our bootstrap base or what we started with. This worked out very well just to get some stuff moving, some trade going, make a little coin. Um, I haven't changed any of this since we started. Uh, yeah, I really, I don't think I've really changed much of this like five episodes ago. This has all been the same. A little bit of farming, a little bit of animal, animal stuff going on. Pretty straightforward of that. Um, this was our old charcoal setup to which I've actually destroyed. Um, realistically, I'm going to be trimming all of this out eventually. We'll get there. I got to get through some of this freaking lumber though. Um... Do you accept, do you just accept lumber straight up? You do, guess what? Happy birthday. Just seriously start selling it. Um, let's see here, yep, there's a smeltery. This is a little proof of concept that came up with when we first got like any amount of real money was I wanted to see if I could automate stuff to the fact where it could be economically self-sufficient all by itself, generate excess energy and some extra coin. And this is, this is exactly what happens. So, uh, copper ore comes in and boards. What this does is this turns the boards into charcoal, which doubles their value just by doing that. That powers a smeltery and a power plant. So this generates more than, than enough electricity for this, and it generates a little bit of coin every time it sells something, which is just copper plates. I could have turned that into copper coils, but I didn't think that far ahead, and I built it out, and I'm like, you know what, screw it, it's fine. Um, so this works out really nice. This actually generates 10 extra megawatts back into the grid. Oh, this actually isn't even connected. <laughs> it's not even actually connected. Um, boop, now it is. Yeah, this and this are the two that I've needed to keep everything going. It's been pretty solid. Um, let's see, this is a sell or destroy area. This is getting rid of clay right now. Or is selling some various products that I just don't want to really... Hello? <laughs> that I just don't want to really deal with. That takes care of that. Um, up here, this is getting rid of stone and rubble. And what it's doing is it's getting it chunked out into all the materials for actual ores. Uh, that's not synced, thank you. Um, it's getting all that stuff broken down into ores. Right here we've got a couple of copper ore right there. Easy stuff. Yeah, easy stuff. Real, real good, real good. Um, so there's that. Uh, that, that, yep. This is the, uh, Boronite? Boronite. <laughs> okay, I knew I'd get there. Uh, Boronite comes in, it gets crushed, 
it gets centrifuged, it gets sent down to a line where it gets separated out and again either sold or dropped off or whatever. And this is supposed to keep all this going on. I also got a stone and clay mine here that is getting pushed out and turned into rubble. Rubble is also getting sent around and all that. I'm going to guess we're full up on this. I have three trains going. I might be able to delete one of them. Because that first one was full and that second one was sad. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to delete this second one right here. I know I have three trains coming to this station. No need for all that. Yeah, I just wanted to catch up, and I think we did. The third one should be showing up really soon now. There it is. As long as it clears the station. Which it almost did. Oh well. Good enough. Um, let's see here. Another little depot where I was hauling and mining stuff. And then right back to here to our charcoal area. So the main thing I wanted to do with this little side thing was I wanted to see how well we could build a train base. And it's very doable. Yeah, it's, it's incredibly doable for sure. 100%. 100%. So let's get started with making some new products, yeah? Uh, I really gotta start turning this around. Let's see here, automatic. Um, electronics factory? The Adams family. Electronics factory. Uh, automatic metal workshop is actually what I really want. Wait. What's the difference between this thing? And this thing? When they both have machine parts as recipes? Outputs to machine parts, 25 seconds. It's the same recipe? It's not It's not any better if I make it in an electronics factory. Copper coil, iron ingot, 25 seconds. Yep. Um, consumption... No, I want to know how much power this thing takes. Is it a power difference? Const Consumption, one megawatt. The electronics factory... The automated electronics factory is actually cheaper than the automated metal workshop because of price. Uh, high-tech construction... Or high-tech build part is more expensive. Also, an electronics factory only requires a stone hammer to make? Interesting. Huh. I definitely need the electronics factory to make the high-tech parts. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Oh, well. Anyway. Um, another thing I wanted to do is I wanted to upgrade these guys into drones. Boop. So that'll get done. Um, let's see here. Let's move you down here. Move you down here. Okay, the first thing that has to get done straight up is coils. The electronics factory is better at making coils. Um, man, I don't have a ton of space in places. Let's maybe do it like this. Now, I could do this one of two ways. I could either get the bars on trains and move them somewhere else that might have a little more open space. A little more open space. We could clear cut this and this could be our manufactory. Or I could use this space here and just push it down and be like, there you go. And by put, I mean like uh, inserters and just be like, insert it down and then make whatever. And then like, that's that. Uh, what else do I need to put on the rail network? Any Oh, carbonate. The carbonate uh, I still need to get on the system. Um... Much more... Okay, now I do want to see the whole map. I have a bunch of room on this right side here. Um... Could do. Could do. Another thing that I could do is I could separate out the rail system. 
I could have a rail system just for ingots to just move ingots down and out here and use this as ingots. So I could I could actually separate this off of the main branch. That might be a cool thing. Let's do that cool thing I just came up with. Bop. Have fun, everybody. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry for this, but have fun, everybody. Um, this isn't necessary anymore. Um, yeah. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Um, yeah, that's, I think that's how I want to do it. So, here's... Here's, oh, crap. Boop, boop. Yeah, I didn't mean to let that get built. I was still kind of figuring out what I wanted to do with my life. Um, for sake of reason... Um... Might have a fun way to do this. And by fun, I mean terrifying. Stay tuned. Nope. Nope. Come on. You can do it! Man, this whole, this whole everything, you can't see me waving my hands, but this whole thing is not happy when I click on stuff. Okay, this is going to be a really simple, dumb system. Um, realistically, I do want to do a little bit of this shenaniganry. Uh, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Uh, what this is going to hopefully do is allow a train to come in and come out and share the one-way path. This is going to allow for a little bit of buffer. Um, because this is going to be fairly short, I actually cannot imagine... I'm going to need too much extra line, so I'm going to peel this down a little bit. Uh-huh. 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 And then this looks like this. Oh. Now. Uh, this cannot go under like that. So actually, we would do this a little differently. Oh, man. I think I'm, I'm, I might be hitting some of the limitations here. <laughs> it's cool. Like I'm willing to tough through it. If the game, if the game will have me, I will tough through it. Oh, can I not? Hold on. Oh no! I thought I could go under. No, no, no! Don't, don't go up. It really does not want to go under? Boo! I thought I could do the a thing with this. And a thing with that. Uh huh. Crap. Uh, let's just do a small test here. Is it like I gotta do the underside first? Or something? Oh, that, that works. Ish. Okay, I can, I can live with this. I can live with all of this. If I, if that's how that's gotta roll, fine. Fine and fair and foo. 
Um, then I'm going to clean this up because this is starting to actually cheese me off a little bit. There's no reason to turn right and then immediately have to turn left. Yeah, if I had to turn right and then immediately turn left just because I could have just stayed the path in the first place, I think I'd lose my mind. Welcome to the United States road system, though. That's a thing. Every day. Uh, okay, now what's your problem? Nope. 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 Oh my god. Crossing one is okay, crossing two is an issue? What if what if we pulled this back a little bit more? And you knew I was like good am I good for the money? No, oh no oh, okay. None of this is what I want. <laughs> there's just there's just a microsecond or whatever of delay, so now when I click a thing, I think I'm clicking a thing. Nope. I have no idea what's happening. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. Okay, incredible. Whew. Harrowing stuff getting done here today, I tell ya. Absolutely harrowing stuff. Okay. So now, I need to get iron and copper to each of these respective spots. And this is going to be very dumb, simple, easy. Um... Oh, 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 hold on. Maybe this is not going to be as easy as I hope. Okay, that's fine. You are... Iron bars, you are copper bars. Okay, I think I'm satisfied with what we got going on. Uh, feel free and resume. Uh, don't, don't, don't need none of that. Where are you taking that? Ah, good. Nowhere. That's where you're taking that. Um, since this left one feels like it's more favored in terms of utilization to do something like this. And then these other two can daisy chain up. It's like that, that, and that. Copy that shiz. Boop, and boop, and boop. And regular shiz. Okay. Cool. Yeah. I think that'll do. Get that built up, get that loaded. These two main products, in addition to, I think, wood and such, can get like four or five of the main products I really care about. Any variation like wheat, bam, automatic wheat grower thingy. Uh, for the wood, I might even just import wood. I haven't decided yet. But okay. Uh, I am going to actually add... Did we talk about this rail design? I don't know if we did. I built a bigger station because I wanted more storage. But the way this is really going to work is um, a train is going to drive to the right, go in, it's going to be like, hey, I want to leave now. And it can leave out a different path and we have this the signals pointing in a certain direction to block. What's happening here? Dude, just build the thing. Waiting construction. You're just dumping crap everywhere. I don't know why we're dumping crap everywhere. I don't know why this is happening. You're allowed to have iron ingots. 
I don't... I, I don't know why... I don't know why everyone's defecating all the iron everywhere. I didn't ask for that to happen. Is this piece claimed? I'll go limit hopper? I just hopper into a limit hopper. What the hell does that mean? Huh. I have no idea what that means. Um, please tell me this is gonna get finished. Yeah, go, go, run like the wind, go. Scamper your pampers, my lad. Uh, note to self, build inserters last. I'm clicking on him and it says Grassland. Apparently his, their name is Grassland. Dan Kroon! That sounds like something you shout, like an enemy or someone like, Khan! Right? Dan Kroon! Okay, please build the thing. Please build the thing. Oh my god. Iron all over the floor. Thank you. Now, can somebody please come over here and pick up all this crap? Wait, is this all... Oh, it's all reserved. Uh, oh, uh, alright. If I unreserve everything, is it gonna be okay? That wasn't loud. You're loud. Um, yeah, we can stop doing that. Uh, is there a hotkey to unreserve an item? Because that would be awesome. <clears throat> I don't think there is. Uh, yeah, I don't think there is. Item that can grow here, a Joshua tree. I don't care about the Joshua tree. Uh, try to see if anyone's going to grab this iron I'm unreserving. Uh, actually, you know what I'm going to try first? Save. Yep. 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 Main menu. Yep. Uh, maybe that'll unsqueezy all the crap that's been reserved. Yep, that unreserved everything. Yep. If something goes weird, reload the game. It does not take long for it to happen, and hopefully that'll fix everything. All the iron will plop into there magically, and that takes care of that. Huh, cool. How's the mining coming along? It definitely is coming along. That is a thing that is occurring. Yep, help that out a little bit. I just need it out of the way. That's all I'm looking for. Uh, yeah, I probably have a lot of haulers already hauling, so I'm not going to expect this to just vanish. But the item's available. That's good. Um, let's see here. What else is next? Uh, you can stop selling wood, because it looks like you're going to work through a bunch of it. Uh, you're running low on charcoal. Kind of okay. That goes away. And... We're full of brick. Are we full of clay? Actually, it looks like we worked through all that clay. Freaking awesome. Awesome to the max. Just to keep the power plant online. 
Just to keep the power plant online, we're going to do this. Um, I am not really in a spot where I can start running more train lines. Not, not at this moment. I'm working on the actual metallurgic part of the game. That I've been waiting so long for. Okay, our little carry toasters are doing stuff. Good, good. Carry toasters. <laughs> I just realized how funny that was. Um, this is all supreme. I love it. This is all... Green stuff goes there. You're not accepting green stuff. That's a problem. You're accepting green stuff. Okay, that should help out very, very much to get rid of some more of this junk. Um, all the various ores will make it back. Yep, because this is completely full for reasons I'll never comprehend. The horses seem pretty amazing as long as you stick it to like three... Um, I think maybe three of the stables or whatever the crap they're called. Stations. I think maybe like less stations is better. Um, they seem like they're bouncing around a whole crap ton, unless you have a lot of stuff that these stations just straight up aren't accepting. You're not full. You should be able to push all kinds of stuff. Yeah, uh, it's weird seeing horses not hauling anything. But that's okay. Okay, iron's getting a little cleaned up. I like that. I like that. There we go. Button that up just a little bit, and then the path above can still come through. Yeah, I'm digging it. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Okay, yep, you're gonna cry about it for a second. If you ain't drifting off the line, are you even living? Look at this mad son of a gun. Frickin' Polar Express, am I right? Toot toot. <laughs> I, I want to read the code. I don't know what this is programmed in, but I want to read the code where the train is like, well, there used to be track here. I don't care who you are. There used to be track here. It's just having like an argument with itself or whatever. No, I don't need to... <laughs> Bring me your manager. There was track here before. I'm gonna ride that shit. And it's just like, well, if you ain't out of control, you ain't in control or whatever. And then it's just like, we... <laughs> um, and whenever it re recalibrates its code or whatever, we're like, guess what, idiots? I'm living my best life. <laughs> it just I wonder I really wonder what causes that to happen. Cuz that's that might be one of my favorite bugs I've ever found in a game ever. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to wait for this to get a little more cleaned up before I lay it out. Effectively it's going to be two stations at What the f what the hell? <laughs> it's not even loading it's the right train. I'm bad at video games. What happened? Do I need okay, let's let's reload one more time. Uh custom map save, yep. <laughs> The, the gantry. But buddy, forget about it. 
It's a gantry. It's just forget about it. It's out of here. Uh, what was I even talking about? I don't know. I don't know what I was talking about. I don't. I don't know what I was talking about. It doesn't matter. Uh, oh my god. So dumb. So funny. Is my favorite bug. <laughs> Uh, ah, man, I, I wish this game was, like, still in, like, full tilt development, because I would love to try to be like, okay, here's how you replicate it. Change a track on a train network. Trust me. And then it just goes bat squiggle bananas. Is this reserved? This is biomaterial or whatever. Item available. Cool, but it's still on the line. Um. Yeah, that was hilarious. That... Very much liked. Just feed into that if you could with the boar knight that's there. Okay, everything else is still okay. I still haven't touched any of my carbonate. It's turning into a real situation of you can't have any pudding if you don't eat your meat kind of a thing. And there's a piece... Let's unreserve that. Uh, I want to see a coal train show up. There's coal on the line, for reasons. Okay, you gonna play? You gonna play nice this time? Yes, you are. Okay, cool. I don't care if you only need two items. That's fine. That's a hundred percent a okay. Um. I don't even think you needed two items, but this is in the wrong spot. I want to see the yeah. I want to see the coal go full circle. It unloaded successfully. Okay, good beans. Super super good good beans. Um, there's probably no chance I could get five more just, uh, yeah, Logi bots, is there? Oh, transport robots, right. Now let's go 35. Can I sell date, uh, cacao beans? Please tell me you'll buy cacao. I don't care if it's for two monies. You'll buy chocolate milk, which requires cacao, at a Terrible price, I might add. This might be build dump, put things in dump, move on with life kind of a thing, right? Okay, looks like we're clearing it out pretty well. Um, this stuff, this tundra is used for mushroom patches, which I don't need. Fertile soil, also mushroom patches, I don't need. Um, if I really, really need... Well, I will want one patch. So I'll probably save, like, this patch... Um, for biomaterial. You don't need a lot. You really, you really don't need a lot for it. Um, I want a... A 1-5... That seems a little too much. Um, I don't need two extra stops, though. This would have been smarter to build, I think. Up there. And maybe in some of these other places where I'm not actually using two trains. But, eh. Yeah, eh, it's fine. It's only still the one gantry, right? Like, I'm not getting free ganch. 
Ganch. <laughs> I'm not getting extra Ganch, right? Um, let's see here. So, uh, let's go ahead and, well, uh, just keep the game going. Is that just oil? There's nothing else here, right? One more cursory look. I'm not interested in oil. I've got like three oil places I could easily tap. If I block this one in, I block it in. It's not that big of a deal, right? We got one here. I also don't care about that one. Um, there's one right where we start. Yeah, right there. And that has been for robots to drink. And they don't even drink that much. They're very... They're very chill on how much they consume, apparently. Yeah, I should have probably used the other stations. But everything's worked out pretty well. Uh, I'm not seeing any of this product go down. Carbonite, carbonate, yeah, carbonate, yeah. That's all. That's all set up. Uh, the horses don't have. Okay, I'm gonna follow one of you. This is driving me nuts. Man, he's definitely given it 150% on that determination score. Whoa! Did he jump? You guys can jump? With the cart? What the hell? Insane. Is it because, like, one station is empty and you're all going to it? See, this one's empty. Or this one's got stuff in it. And no, one, no one's going for that one either. You stopped. You, you stopped. To get the stuff that no one's paying attention to. It's not forbidden. I think the horse stations are just done. Uh, maybe all the items are reserved? By bots or something? I would have imagined an exodus. Yeah, you went all the way there, you came all the way back with no item. Good job. Okay. I I don't know I don't know what's wrong. It's been working for quite some time and now it's not working at all. Uh Any you want to grab the gold ore, iron ore? It's in here. This does show it has stuff, right? I don't think any of my horses work anymore. <laughs> I think all my horses are borked. They're haborked. Okay, you're feeding that. Don't feed that anymore. You feed that. You have all the stuff, iron ore, wood, all the things. And I want you to come here. No dice. Iron ore, boronite ore. Uh... I don't know what to do. <laughs> I think I think too many trains or too many of something is kind of borked stuff. Um, let's see, are you... Is this loading at least still good? Is this all, all this working out alright? Nope. You didn't pick up anything. Oh, because this is full. Because this is busted. Is this item reserved? Item in transit. Nope. The item borks, not the inserter. Maybe. Okay, so that dude didn't get anything because the station was full. Yep, you're gonna arrive empty. Now, not this next train, but the next train should have stuff on it. I wonder what automatically reserves items so that something thinks... Uh, what's happening is... Item in transit. 
What's happening is something claims ownership over an item and says, I own this. I'm on my way. Don't worry about it. I got it. And while it's on the way, something else is supposed to interact with it and it doesn't. And then it just breaks. So now the next train should be bringing me the good blue. The sweet, sweet blue stuff. Uh, I should have two trains that are full, actually. Uh, it takes a second. It takes a little while. They're going to the other end of the map. And there should be another one right behind you. Well, it's going to be a little delayed because it has to load. Yeah, as long as I can keep, I don't know, one crusher running all the time, I only really needed the two crushers. I swear to God, there's a second train. <laughs> I just have no idea where to... There it is. There's our guy. Yeah, I'm actually having a hard enough time keeping up with one of these. Uh, busy all the time. But that's okay. That's getting us some stuff. Uh, we still have some rock here. Is this... Is this reserved? Just stop a second here. Conveyor belt. Item reserved. We don't know by what. We don't know by what. We don't know by what. But it's all reserved. It's still reserved. Interesting. Now, hold on. I really want to fall in love with this game and get really, like, way more detailed with my builds. Um, I've been taking this build and this little side series a little on the slower side. Um, because I wanted to really better understand what might be breaking and how it might be breaking. Um, I still, I'm still enjoying myself. Like, I'm still gonna chuck these on YouTube. I'm still gonna be like, hey, it's, it's a neat game. Check out the, check it out. I don't know. Uh, take the lessons that I've learned and judge for yourself if the game's worthwhile. I don't know. Like I said, I'm still having a fun time. So now, let's see if those rocks are still reserved. They are still reserved. Interesting. And this one is reserved by something else entirely. If I could click it. Actually, this one looks reserved, too. Okay, it's reserved because somebody's going to come get it. I wonder if the robots screw this up? That's so weird. I have three pieces of rock that are reserved, and now that's clay. That's fine. Where are you guys going? Maybe, maybe if I shut off wherever you're going... What if I said, don't use this as a stockpile? Maybe something like that is the issue. Uh, so, unreserve. 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 I expect you to grab this rock. Damn. Are you reserved already? I wish I knew by what. Um, hang on. There's the settings. Debug cheat mode. Access more debug options. F7. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Force rain. Advanced time. Claim entire map. Remove fog of war. Kill all. En Ugh. Advance all plants by one growth stage. Delete all unreserved items. Uh. Move to our targets. Target ego camera. Use error to move the camera. Mouse to rotate the cam. Useful for making screenshots. Not useful. For okay, that's cute. I don't know what that does. 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 Okay. Audio debug panel. Add 100 money to your shipping port. Clear current objectives. Fill boat. Save camera position. Load camp. Dang it. What I was actually hoping for was, like, click on a thing and it tells you, hey, uh, this is reserved by some... Oh. 
All right, well, that's messed up now. Um, a little more debugging, debugging, because I have no idea what's reserving these three stones all the time. Something is, though, and it can't figure out how to get it. So there's, there's a legit bug there, I think. Um, also, all our horsey stalls are screwed up. Absolutely 100%. And that is loud as hell. Item available. Uh... I guess before... Man, I was hoping I could go a little farther with this before, like, calling it a season. Um... I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up my new... Oh, you guys really dusted that up pretty sweet. Nice. Um, before I call this, if it's if we're gonna be like, you know what, we gave it a good shake, it's not gonna happen, which could be the case. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up my smelter or not smelter, my manufacturing area. That this is what I want to do. This is how I want to knock this out. Uh, one five is totally fine. Oh no, uh Yeah, I want I want bigger. I want the bigum boys. Where'd you go? My short term memory is so short. Oh no, I'll just do one, two wait. Oh it does have rail. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I should I should have just been using the other one. It's fine. Um here we go. So this is gonna look something like this. Perfect. Yep, I like it. Uh, so how do we do that? We got to here? Nope, not yet. Uh, up, uh, nope. I can dig on that. Hell yeah, I can dig on that. I can dig on that all night. I can dig on that all night. That goes away. Uh, one. Tr hold on. I want. I want room for two trains easily without a problem. Let's see here. There's one. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, that actually fits pretty freaking well. <clears throat> so if I do this. Three, four, five. That's not quite good enough. Uh, which is fine. We'll do a little loop de loo action. A little skip to my loo action. Actually, that might be enough. That's barely enough. Let's let's just cut ourselves a little extra slack. I'm not gonna worry about waste or anything at this juncture. I don't think. Uh, boop. And a boop. Boop. And a boop. Okay. And then we do this. Oh, let's come out one. I like I like coming out by just just one like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then stop. 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 Perfect. Okay. There's our line. I need a rail factory. Is this too big? What's the problem? Oh, it's one square too big. Um, 
Yeah, I'm gonna move this by one. I think I like the look of that a little bit better. There we go. Uh, there we are. Okay, I want to do the signaling and stuff before I hit resume. There's actually not going to be a lot to do here. And incredibly loud horses for the win. Or something, uh, that might be the mill. I have no idea what's making that noise. Okay, that's it. Now we'll work on getting all the materials set up. We'll get some trains to run in, and then we'll work on everything else as that's being built. One, two. One, two. You are copper. It doesn't matter which one I do. You're copper, you're iron. I want this all built out, and then we'll start working on the actual factory bits. The idea, ultimately, is this is all manufacturing space. All all of this. I don't know if you can see that very well. All this, and then all this is manufacturing space. Then I'll set up another little rail ter terminal here for any other products that need to go out, and then bam. Or whatever. Um, we could siphon off maybe some wood planks. I've already got a full factory here. I also wouldn't think twice if we wanted to just set up a shipping thing and just do that. And just bring in wooden planks and stuff like that. I wouldn't mind it if that was how that went down. Sorry, that was me. I had to crack my knuckles all frickin' day, it seems. 24,000 monies, that's not bad. Uh, what's going on here? Are we full? Is a third train the answer? I thought we were doing pretty freaking good with two trains, but maybe three trains is the answer. Full load? Okay, three trains is 100% the answer. I could always put that one back. Build train there. And there. Thanks much. Okay. We got some train storage going on. Awesome. I'm going to need... Oh, uh, let's set up the thing. Um, is this one copper? That one's copper. Copper. Iron. Train, iron, iron, train, copper, copper, train, iron, iron, train, copper, copper. Okay. So now these should be able to just reverse and without an issue go on to the next thing. Beautiful sauce. Yep. So this one's blocking, which is unfortunate. Uh, oh. Craps. Uh, no, I don't care about the signal. I want to click the train. I can't click ignore signals yet. We'll pull this out a little bit. There we go. Ignore signals. Thank you. Uh, keep, keep ignoring signals. Uh, are you stuck? Oh my god, keep ignoring signals. 
<laughs> ah, craps. We'll fix it. I know exactly how to fix it. I just have to pull out this uh, junction a little bit, and we will be a-okay. Oh, wow. You... Don't move. Once you're in the next block, I expect you to just be able to go. There we go. Thank you. Okay. Now, this needs to get cut. And pause. This will come down a little like this. Make this really easy. Boom. So now we set up the signals accordingly. There we go. Now you may proceed. And block, block, block. There we go. That will not be a problem anymore. Stuff is going to freak out a little bit because I'm still changing things, of course, of course. There we go. That's it. Just had to pull this out a little bit. There wasn't a clean way to break up that intersection. But by doing this, this ensures copper is never a part of the issue. Now what I might do is I might stacker this while we're here to make sure this train can wait without blocking iron. A little bit of tweaking. A little bit of tweaking. This won't take long, I assure you. But something like this will work perfectly. It'll build enough slack in the line, and it'll make sure, like I said, the both copper trains can get the hell out of the junction. And iron shan't be bothered no more. It's messy, right? It's it's kind of messy, actually. While I'm touching things, while while we're here. Yeah, this this is better. This is better, I think. Don't hold me to any of that. <laughs> Come on, where are you going with the, what the hell? What? You're loading this train on this side of the line? Where the hell is this going? Okay, I broke everything again. Uh, that needed to be there. <coughs> There's iron. Oh my god. Uh, <coughs> item in transit. I don't think... I don't think that's the case of what's happening right now. Uh, why aren't you moving? What the hell? I've, I've got <coughs> two... The game's absolutely shattered. There's two copper trains. He's just still loading. He's still loading. Okay. Okay. Stop. Stop. Yes. We're gonna we're gonna relog the whole game. Um Man, I really wish I came to this game like two years ago. So I could have been like helpful part of the de of the dev team. Cause that's something I've been asked to do a lot, uh, when it comes to indie devs. Is like um, I'll get keys to play games, and I've gotten emails. It's like, oh, I don't, you like, your your YouTube channel's not the Giga Millions. And I'm like, yeah, it's not, it wasn't really my goal. If I wanted to be clicky and edgy and whatever, sure, I could get more subs, but that's not really why I do this. Um, and they said, yeah, we, we get that. Um, but what we're looking for is, like, someone that, like, understands gaming and what gaming ought to, like, feel like or be like and like someone who's been gaming for 30 years that would be cool i just i'm not picking on the devs here i'm just saying like i really wish i could have been more involved with this one because i love it i love i love the graphic style i like a lot about the game um i'm just doing something wrong maybe and we're finding a rough spot but i'm still glad i went through this this extra season to really you know, build a rail base and do that, and that's what I wanted to accomplish. Um, I don't think I'll be able to get to the manufacturing portion.
Okay. The gantry is no longer loading the train. That's good. The train is also active. But it does not know where it needs to go. This is kind of why I wanted to separate these out so that way there'd be less uh, stress on one single rail line. Yeah, where's where's this guy going? I think you're just... Oh, okay. I stopped it and restarted it. And now this other train is eating it. And now you're leaving. And now you're loading, but you're not in the station. There's like a hundred copper blocks sitting here. That I have to un... Unreserve. Okay, I wanna hold on. I wanna see what this this station is gonna do. Uh didn't you have copper on you? Like I thought you had some copper on you. Or is it all in this one block? No, don't feed this guy anymore. He's not responsible with his porridge. <laughs> okay. Um I don't know what I don't know what sins I may have committed in a prior life. Okay, you are unloading properly now. That's a good sign. I committed some crazy nonsense in a prior life, I'm guessing. Something done broke, Sarge. Um I guess I don't have to correct these copper ingots floating in space, but I would like to. Man, how many more... How many more is left? This is insane. Um... I'm gonna clean this up, because I really want to. We have some overstacked copper bars, which is fine. Let's give a health check right now. Let's spend the next, like, three minutes going over a health check of everything. Maybe this is where our run ends, unfortunately. Um, I was hoping having less settlers would make the logic better, but I went a little too ham on the logical bots. The, the logistics bots, maybe? Um, I think our horse network is completely dead. This is still very full. Uh, let's set up another one to see if we can recover. I think I've got at this stage too much broken crap and it's not going to work anymore. I think that might be where I'm at. Uh, we'll see. I want to load this up. We're going to send the horses back to the other logistics center. See if we can get any work done here. Yeah, it's that one. With or 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 bop bop bop. Anything else really? That's not the right thing, that's the right thing. And that loads up. Yep, three trains are totally necessary for that. 100%. No exception. We gotta purge out this red stuff, which I'm gonna build a train and just get that going on. Um, I think we still have the filter set, right? Uh, we do. Cool. So here we go. Train. Go there. Go there. Thanks. Okay, I really genuinely want to see how this works. Zoom. Oh, 
One horse. One horse showed up with a thing. Did that? Did that fix? Oh, another horse showed up with another one thing. I'm almost excited. Uh, if the answer is delete a couple things and rebuild the things, and that fixes stuff, okay, I could, I could probably play that. There's one horse grabbing one thing. Okay, thank you. Now this is, but well, was black a second there? You didn't grab anything. Oh, one, one guy, one thing. Nope. You didn't grab anything? Do they just bounce in between each of the stations? Okay, I'm gonna try my other idea. We're gonna do way less stations. Nuke, nuke, nuke. It said the limit is 10, but I don't think that's helping me at all. Um, This is a, st so we have one station here. Also, is this busted? Toggle overflow hopper. I don't know what that means. Turn this hopper into an overflow hopper. Uh, yeah, that's all the types. Is this item reserved? Item in transit. No, it isn't. Item in transit. Stockpile zone CC15. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. So now what I should have are literally two car horse carriage things. Oh, okay. We're grabbing some stuff now. Okay. Too many stations. That's That was our problem with that. Too many stations ruins the game. That Okay, that makes me feel a little bit better. Uh, the game limit says 10 stations. I don't think that's accurate. So is a horse going to come and grab stuff here constantly? Pick up, pick up. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. It's working now. Um, you didn't grab anything. And you didn't grab anything. Um, uh, well, our ratio is a lot higher. Are all the other stations deleted? Yep, that's deleted. That's deleted. Um, I think there's just some upper limit that's getting hit. And it's not having a good time about it. Realistically, I'm going to get to a point where I don't need horses anymore at all. Uh, because I'm going to have everything nice and taken care of by train or whatever. But I think I'm still hitting a different limit here. Um, here's what I'm going to do. Um, I either keep going or I stop, right? That's kind of where I'm at. Uh, I'm willing to give one more episode worth of try. So I'm going to call this here. Let's take a nice screenshot right here for our uh, thumbnail, yeah? Get in there real good. And uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's step away. Let's come back in a bit. Let's see if we can do some damage. And let's see if we can get our factory working without uh, more crashes or more more issues. Yeah, um, I'm thinking we're just doing something a little non-intentional and it's causing issues, but we'll see. Anyway, I'm feeling optimistic. We'll push through. We'll see if we can get something of a factory going, and that'll be that. So thanks for joining me, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.